you have the Motorola Moto G Go. Looks like this cool camera panel on the back, sensor on the back. You've had it for a while and you're wondering if it can go a little faster, run a little faster for you. The answer is yes. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you how to go into the guts of the phone called the developer options. And then we'll make some changes inside the what's called the animations. It's how fast that you switch in between uh, whenever you change your app. And then this is a one 5G Ace, which is a little bit newer. And then we'll compare them side by side. And you can see with your own eyes, just making a few changes will, will help your phone feel like it's running quicker, snappier, faster. And then if you don't like it, I'll show you how to turn it off make, and change it back to default. All right, so let's get started. All we have to do is go into settings, touch settings. We're going to go way to the bottom. We're going to go to about. And inside about, you're going to look for something way down at the bottom called build number. And all we have to do is touch this seven times. One, two, three, four. You should start getting a message. Five, six, seven. It should say you are now a developer. Okay, if it doesn't say that yet, you haven't touched it enough times or it's already in developer mode. All right, so let's go back one. And now watch this. When you touch system and advanced, developer options are right here. So let's touch it. By default, it's on, and I'm going to turn it off and back on so we can read the warning. Allow development settings. These settings are intended for development use only. They can cause your device and applications on it to break or misbehave. That just means don't touch anything. Don't touch anything accidentally, and if you do, just back up, cancel, or just get out of developer options, or come all the way back up here and turn them off. All right, so what we want to do, and I say that because we have to scroll way down, so if you accidentally touch, it's possible to accidentally touch something. We're looking for a heading called Drawing. This is called Networking. The next one is Input, and then right after Input is Drawing, right there. Now, the changes we're going to make are, the like I referred to, animations. So we've got these three, Windows Animation Scale, Transition Animation, Animator Duration. Now, all we have to do is touch them to change them. Some people say to change it to 0.5 and it'll be a little faster. Definitely don't make it a bigger number because then your phone's going to be super slow. I like to run with my animations off. Okay, I'm going to do the next one. Transition, off, animator duration, off. And that's all we do. Okay, now when you t to exit developer options, don't push off because it'll set everything back to default and we won't see any changes. Just touch home screen now. Now watch this. With your own eyes, watch what happens. I'm just going to bring up the dialer. Okay, I'm going to close the dialer. Bring up the dialer again. Close the dialer. Do you see how that blinks on, blinks off, and this one animates open, animates close? Let's do it with Messenger. That was about the same. Let's close Messenger. That's definitely faster on this side. One more time. I just factory reset this one so there's not even any of the functionality inside the cache of the phone. So let's do it twice on camera. Close camera. Oh, that's very, very different. Close camera. This one blinks off and this one takes a minute to close all the way. Watch. There you go. Now, if you are using your phone a lot and you go from messenger to camera to take a phone call to another app, back and forth, back and forth. Your phone is going to feel snappier, quicker, faster on this side making these changes. If you make those changes and you like how your Motorola runs now, uh, leave that you did in the comments. Now, if you don't like it, let's change them back. It's super easy. Let's go back into settings, touch settings. We're going to go to developer options again. That's inside system, system, advanced, developer options. And all we have to do is turn it off, off, and it sets everything back to default. And you, we'll double check, and you'll see that the drawing options now. Oh, did I go too far? I went too far. There's input. There's drawing. Okay, they're all blanked out, but you can see that they're back to one X, the default one X and one X. And now when they're off. You won't accidentally touch them. They don't even show up in the uh, they don't even show up in the options inside system. All right, and that's how you make your Motorola Moto G Go run a little bit faster or feel like it's running faster. Hey, if this has helped you, please like, please subscribe. Thank you for watching.